today we are going to discuss about how to export images and data file from cst for this at first we have to go to cst and we have to open an antenna that we have designed or you have designed so uh, here I'm trying to open an antenna I have designed. Basically, it's an E-shaped antenna where an E-shaped slot and I-shaped slot is inserted into the patch. Um, there is nothing more to be discussed about this antenna as it is not my concern. My concern is that the output of this antenna and how to export the images uh, of these antennas uh, for our further processing. This is uh, as parameter which we open called as reflection coefficient or return loss but it is uh, better to call it as reflection coefficient as you know from several discussions and there are other figures like bsw or as we know bsw and and as parameter gives almost same information and uh, radiation efficiency curves and we also have uh, our tables where we see that uh, axial ratio as it is a C, it is an it is a cp antenna we have axial ratio and maximum gain over frequency curves so at first i will discuss about how to export these images then i will discuss about how to export data okay for this uh, at first uh, if we like to export as parameter then we have to go to view and then we have to go to export image. After going to export images, you will find that there are two types of images you can export BPN image or PNG image, BMP and PNG file. It is uh, better to export PNG file because the resolution of PNG file is much better than BMP file. So you can, uh, if you would like to use these figures uh, in future then it is better to use png file if you export uh, temporarily uh, files for temporary uh, part-time use or temporary um, use you can export bmp file okay for export png file you have to select png file here then uh, you have you can select a location uh, suitable location you can select any suitable location so Public satellite antenna. I have selected and I have to make a new folder and make image. You can export uh, images in any where. So, as at first, you have to write the name of the file as 11, or we can even call it a reflection, reflection coefficient. So, and press save. So this is how we can export images from csd file we can export any image in similar fashion for a better understanding i'll discuss about how we can also export the radiation efficiency curves for radiation efficiency curves uh, we can export it okay view and export image okay here you have to select png file radiation efficiency okay and set here is the uh, png file of radiation efficiency you can also export bsw file okay png 
BSWR passive. Okay, that is uh, that is the way basically to export images. You can also export Excel ratio or gain gain over maximum efficiency for Excel ratio. We have to do the same work. Export images. PNG file axial ratio set. This is how we can export images from CST. Now I am going to discuss about how to export data. That is, uh, as you see, the carp is not so good that we can present it in any conference paper or we can use it in any journal for this we have to redraw the figure for redrawing purpose we have to export the data for this what we have to do is that we have to go to post processing option then we have to plot data ascii we have to um, press this export option plot data ascii and here I press it and then and in the same way we can save it in our PC in any selected folder. Uh, as we already save it in antenna, satellite antenna. So we, I'd like to save in, in same folder. So I can name this as Excel ratio dot text. Okay, I save it. There is Excel ratio. Then we can also save maximum game over frequency curve. For this, we have to do the same procedure. Go to post processing, then plot data, select plot data, then select select gain as write the name gain and then save. In the similar fashion, you can export any data you want to export okay uh, for example if i like to export the data of reflection coefficient i can also export it reflection coefficient save okay let let us check the data mm, reflection coefficient acceleration etc so for this we have to go to D drive satellite antenna okay images here we save it axial ratio gain reflection coefficient okay here is the axial ratio so here is the axial ratio for from this we have seen that at 29 gigahertz here is the gigahertz data we got 0 0.84 the minimum axial ratio is 0 0.84 uh, we can also uh, process these data. For example, if we export the data of radiation efficiency, then what is going to be happen? We can check. Here is the data. Here is the radiation efficiency. If we uh, export it for this, we have. If we export it, uh, export import plot data. Radiation efficiency. Mm. Okay. So here is the radiation efficiency. As we know, we always like to express efficiency in percentage rather than in zero to one range. So for the for this we can modify this data. We have just uh, modify it in notepad as the data number is not so high we can also modify the data in excel today i am going to show you how to modify data in notepad in next session i'll discuss about how to export data and modify them according to the necessity in excel file okay for this what we have to do is that just remove the point as we have to or multiply is by 100 just use this point after two digits okay here is it is here it is here it is in this way just by pressing arrow in your 
laptop you can easily do it if you go to of your laptop just delete it by pressing del and delete and backspace here it is now it's it in the data is expressed in percentage 100% now just save it okay now if we open it then what do you see there is our data now in next session i'll discuss how to fraud these datas in uh, another data frauding software namely igor thank you for watching this video